John chapter 16 verse 33 and the charge is titled be of good cheer be of good cheer that's the title of the charge this this is specific for somebody he said these things have I have spoken unto you that in me you might have peace in the world you have tribulation but be of good cheer i have overcome the world these things i am speaking to you that you might have peace in the world tribulation is inevitable in the world the system of the world where we are in but be of good cheer I have overcome the wall. If I didn't preach anything anymore, if I, don't, if I don't see anything on the basis of this scripture, it's enough. I am speaking to you so that you can have peace, he said. What you have in the world is called tribulation. But don't let the tribulation move you. Be of good cheer. I have overcome the wall this same scripture if you look at it in the living bible version if we have the living bible version they might place it on the screen otherwise he said i have told you all these so that you will have peace of heart and mind here on earth you will have many trials and sorrows he said but cheer up for i have overcome the world i have told you all this so that you will have peace of heart and mind here on earth you will have many trials and sorrows but cheer up i have overcome the world cheer up cheer up i have overcome the wall the bible speaking also in the message bible he said i have told you all this so that trusting me you will be unshakable and assured deeply at peace in this godless world you will continue to experience difficulties but take heart i have conquered the world take heart i have conquered the world let me end it up with the amplified version he said i have told you these things so that in me you may have perfect peace and confidence this is the amplified version classic version all right perfect peace and confidence in the world you have tribulation and distress and suffering tribulation trials distress the classic version says frustration but be of good cheer take courage be confident setting undaunted for i have overcome the world I have deprived now this one said my conquest is accomplished my victory abiding this said i have overcome the world i have deprived it of power to harm you and i have conquered it for you i have overcome the world i have deprived it of power to harm you and i have conquered it for you incredible i have overcome the world i have deprived it of power to harm you and i have conquered it for you Let's, let's outline five things here out of that scripture. Be of good cheer or cheer up. Number one, God is interested in the peace of his people. The peace or the welfare of his people. He said, I am speaking to you for the sake of your peace. I am interested in your peace. I am interested in your welfare. I am interested in your serenity, your tranquility, your equanimity. I am interested. 
I want things to be well with you. God is interested in the peace and the welfare of his people. No wonder the Bible said in 2 Thessalonians chapter 3, verse 16, that the Lord, now the Lord of peace himself, give you peace always, by all means. The Lord be with you all. God is interested in the peace of his people, in the welfare of his people. God wishes his people well. Number two, the, the word of God is the channel of the peace of God. He said, these things I have spoken to you that you might have peace. That is, I use my word to transmit my peace. The word of God is the channel of the peace of God. So nobody can be at peace who is disconnected from the word. Nobody can be at peace who is disconnected from the word. The word of God is the channel for the peace of God. That is why we are here daily to speak to you. I'm sure you must understand how demanding it will be to just be doing this daily. But because the word of God contains and transmits the peace of God, we are there releasing that peace through that word. The tape messages, the CDs, and all that can surround you with peace. It's the word of God that is the antidote to the depressions and the things in the air. I was reading on the news how someone in isolation in the UK committed suicide yesterday. That is not your portion. That is why you, you must be connected to the world. Not to tip into any form of depression or anything at all. God is interested in the peace of his people. The word of God is the vehicle of the peace of God. Third thing to know is that the world... is filled with tribulation for as long as we live in this world it is impossible not to see distractions he said in the world you have tribulation in the world you there will be diversities of distractions diversities of issues diversity say it's not news don't be shocked because in the world you shall have tribulation. In the world there will be distractions. Coronavirus distractions. There was the Ebola virus distraction some time back. The SARS distraction some time back. In the world there will be distractions. But this is where you, he's talking to you. He said, number four, never lose your joy despite the distractions of the world never lose your joy in the world you have tribulation but be of good cheer be of good cheer never lose your joy never lose your peace be of good cheer never lose your joy never lose your peace never lose your confidence in god why number five the master has won the victory on your behalf. The master has won the victory. I have overcome the world. I overcame coronavirus before it came. I overcame the situations you are passing through now before it came. I have overcome the world. The Amplified Version Classic Translation said something I like. It said, for I have overcome the world. I have deprived it of the power to harm you. I have overcome the world. I have deprived it of the power to harm you. And I have conquered it for you. It deprived coronavirus the power of harming you. It deprived the stress of this season the power of harming you. I have deprived it of the power to harm you. I conquered it on your behalf. Hallelujah. This should keep you on as we are at the tail, very tail end of the situations. God is mindful of you, is interested in your peace and welfare. And the, the word of God is the channel of the peace of God. The world is filled, loaded with tribulation, and it's no news. 
but never lose your joy despite the distractions of the world cheer up be of good cheer like we heard yesterday joy is a choice not a gift and because the master has won the victory on your behalf hallelujah thank you father we love you 